understanding love's labor lost an insight into idiomatic expressions hello everyone welcome to our english language learning series today we're diving into the fascinating world of idiomatic expressions specifically focusing on the phrase love's labor lost this phrase isn't just a collection of words but carries a deep meaning and historical significance which we will explore together. So, let's embark on this linguistic journey and unravel the layers behind this intriguing expression. The phrase, love's labor lost, originates from the title of a play written by William Shakespeare. Shakespeare, a prominent figure in English literature, often used creative and expressive language in his works. This particular title has transcended its literary roots to become a common expression in the English language. It refers to the efforts, labors, and love that end up being futile or unfruitful. At its core, love's labor lost speaks to the universal experience of unrequited love or efforts in romance that do not lead to the desired outcome. It's used to describe situations where someone has put considerable effort into winning someone's affection or maintaining a relationship, only to have those efforts fail or go unappreciated. In contemporary usage, the phrase has evolved beyond romantic contexts. It can be applied to any situation where one's efforts or hard work do not yield results or are rendered meaningless. For example, it could describe a student's extensive preparation for an exam that gets cancelled, or an athlete's rigorous training for an event that they ultimately do not participate in. Understanding idioms like, love's labor lost, is crucial in English language learning as they enrich one's ability to express complex ideas succinctly. However, it's important to use them appropriately. They are best used in more informal settings or literary discussions and should be avoided in formal or professional communication where clarity is paramount. And that's a wrap on, Love's Labor Lost. We hope this video has shed light on the beauty and complexity of idiomatic expressions in English. Remember, language is not just about words but the stories and history they carry. Happy learning! and see you in our next video where we'll explore more fascinating aspects of the English language.